Hello and welcome to the Comedy News. My name is Katerina and I'm here today outside the renowned Cavendish Arms site and I'm actually yet to locate a female comedian, but I will let you know when I find one. Oh, he called me his little koala bear. Oh. Because I, I'm cute and cuddly, I sleep a lot and I've got chlamydia. <laughs> She found someone who witnessed the gig. I'm here with, excuse me, excuse me, excuse me, I'm here, I'm here with, what's your name? What's your name? Dave. Um, so were you intending to come and see a bit of comedy tonight? Um, what were your plans for the evening? I was indeed. I was planning on coming down for a pint, you know, it's good service here. It's good atmosphere, you know what I mean? And they do good comedy, so I thought I'll, I'll, I'll take a seat, you know what I mean? Uh, so I took a seat and uh, quite frankly, I was shocked by what I saw. Uh, I still haven't processed it, if I'm being perfectly honest, you know what I mean? Mm, interesting, right. So um, tonight, obviously, you saw a female comedian performing. Was it up your street? Was it the kind of material that you would enjoy? Uh, it's too soon to say. Um, as I said, I'm still processing it, you know. Don't, don't question that, you know what I mean? Mm, interesting. I, I saw the female approaching the stage. I saw her embarking, getting on the stage. I saw her on her journey to the stage. I thought, what's she doing? What's she doing up there? So I said, I shouted, what are you doing up there? What are you doing up there? And uh, she didn't answer me. I still don't know what she was doing up there. Mm, well, you seem quite affected by this, Dave. Would you say that it actually ruined your evening? I think it's quite safe to say that I am, I am shocked. I have been changed by this event. And uh, life will never be the same again, okay? Now I'm busy, darling. Okay, okay, thank you. So we've heard it here first. For Dave, this has been a life-changing experience. So comedy can also actually change lives. Back to you in the studio. And I'm still yet to locate a female comedian. So, oh, oh my goodness, I have found a female comedian. Hello, hi. Um, so can I just ask you, um, were you just doing a gig? Yeah. Oh, great, great. And how do you feel the gig went? Good. Yeah, it was really good. So you're a female comedian and you're also funny. Yeah. Wow, wow. So I also wanted to ask you, um, you speak a lot about sex um, when you do your gigs. Does yeah. that mean that you want to have sex with everyone in the audience? Uh, no, no, it does not. Just because I mention sex in front of people doesn't mean I necessarily want to have sex with any of them. Mm, to mm. me, that's pretty obvious, but... Mm, yeah, see, it wasn't very obvious to me, and I don't think it's very obvious to the viewers at home. So, again, um, you speak about sex, but that does not mean you want to have sex with everyone in the audience. Yeah, that's right, that's mm. right. That's, mm. that's great. Thank you so much for your time today. Yeah. It's been brilliant. Um, would you mind just doing a little wave to camera, if that's okay, just just for the viewers? Uh, yeah, yeah, sure. yeah, that'd be great. Yeah, just Bye. keep waving. Big smiles, big smiles. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Tits and teeth, tits and teeth. Thank you. Thank you. Wow. Exciting stuff. Mind-blowing. <laughs>